My name is Christine Graves. Um, most people know me as Tina Graves. I am Pastor Graves' wife. Uh, I guess I would be considered First Lady of Cornerstone Community Church in Millville, New Jersey. I didn't see then where the Lord was taking us. So, you know, I just sat back and just watched where the Lord was taking us. And next thing you know, he was talking about coming to Millville to um, pastor. And I didn't like it. Um, I didn't like it because it took him away from me, so to speak, uh, when he was doing all of the research and trying to find some place to worship. And, you know, it, it, it took him out of the house physically, so to speak. So, you know, and I thought I had a relationship with the Lord, but I really developed one over these past 12 years. Uh, he just really laid it on my heart and, and just said, listen, this is what you've been called to do. You will plant a church for me. And I said, well, Lord, I, I don't know how to plant a church. And uh, that very next day, um, one of my mentors, just in conversation, put me in, in contact with the church planting organization. Um, and uh, I linked up with them and I, I went to school and we learned how to plant the church. And we held Bible studies in a fruit packing plant first for um, uh, maybe eight months. Uh, and uh, then after that, um, we contacted a, a hotel in, in Millville, New Jersey. I knew the Lord was calling me to Cumberland County. After you know talking to my father and, and really searching, I asked God where his, his where where was he moving? Where was his next move? Um, I didn't want to make the mistake of of planting something or starting something in a place where he had not sent me. Um, I think it's 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 ridiculous to start something and ask God to join you when it's much easier to find out where God is working and join him in what he's already doing. And so uh, he, he showed us Cumberland County. Then he got real specific and showed us Millville. I had never even heard of Millville. Uh, we have an ongoing joke that when the Lord was telling me where to go, it started with an M and, and I was hoping he said Miami, but uh, he said Millville. <laughs> so we ended up in Millville. So we, um, we contacted a couple hotels, uh, the Best Western, and uh, the manager's name there is Raj Patel. Um, he said, sure, you can worship here on the weekends. And we used the conference room on Sunday nights at uh, 6 p.m. And on Wednesday nights, we had Bible study there. And he gave us a real reasonable price. And the eight of us, we were having some strong church. <laughs> it was about eight of us, uh, eight to ten of us. And, and we were learning how to have church. We were learning. Uh, we, we had a relationship with, with Christ. And we were, had very intense Bible studies. And um foundations of, of, um, of, of the gospel, uh, too busy not to pray. We went through all these different books, uh, but then on Sunday evenings, we learned how to really put together a, a, a church service. To hear my husband talk about this vision that God had given him and to go along with it, it took some steps on my part before it became my vision as well. For one, my faith had to increase in God in saying, you know what, Lord, he's yours, not mine. You gave him to me as a, as a partner in this life, but he's yours. He has to do your will. And I need to be obedient to you by being by his side. 